today we're going to talk about a movie called Block Z. It's a horror movie, zombie movie, produced by Mikhail Ridd. They produced it starting, actually shooting it starting uh, March 2019 and they finished in July 2019 for five months. It's a zombie movie, Filipino made in Quezon City and Manila. And it was out just as the coronavirus. Here's some of the cast in the movie. They did a great job. Lots of people came and gone and there was only two left at the end of the movie. The funny thing about the movie is that it was released just as the time the coronavirus outbreak occurred. Exactly the same time. And in the movie, there was a virus. It was actually a virus and it spread is a zombie movie so it's quite interesting that this movie came out exactly the same time that the coronavirus came out very interesting i was like what the heck it took place in a medical school a bunch of seniors and basically it infected the virus infected like a rabies and infected and it kept spreading through people and people and it's basically a survival movie uh, they're trying to get to the hospital to the helipad so they could fly away and uh, it's a complete zombie movie about medical students and they're trying to get to the hospital and they go through a pool area, gym, uh, church, and they're trying to get themselves out of the zombie area. It's very exciting. It reminds me of the movie uh, Night of the Living Dead. When I was like five years old or seven years old, my cousin back in Pennsylvania, he said, if you watch this movie, I'll give you like 50,000 pesos or like a thousand dollars. Just watch this movie and go sleep by yourself outside. And I said, okay, I would do that. So I watched Night of the Living Dead. And afterwards I said, uh, -uh I'm not gonna go outside and sleep because in Pennsylvania, they actually don't have any walls or any fences. You just, every everything's wide open. And I was scared to death. And I said, I will not go. And this movie reminds me of that, a zombie movie. Very cool, like Night of the Living Dead, Dawn of the Dead, Day of the Dead, a zombie movie. And made in the Philippines. You should watch that one. Here's the papa and the daughter. They have a hard time with the tuition and they realize that here we are trying to get out of this mess. So here is a group of uh, senior medical students. They are realizing that they must fight to survive. And when people get bit, they get the virus. And guess what? They turn into the zombies. And they're eating more living people. The zombies against the humans. Lots of action, lots of excitement, uh, running from scene to scene. The zombies would like let you know. The college students keep planning their escape route to try to get away from the zombies. They want to arrive to the hospital, to the helipad, to get out of danger. It was a good movie. I give it thumbs up. Some people don't like it and some people do. It's kind of like a real zombie movie, like a Dawn of the Dead, Day of the Dead, Night of the Living Dead. It's just a standard zombie movie. The plot doesn't have to be perfect. It's a zombie movie. You just go there to be entertained, to be scared, to scream. I mean, that's what it's all about. And they made a really good movie, considering it's the Philippines. I think that's the first zombie movie ever made in the Philippines. So they did a very good job. Thumbs up on that one. Zombie movie. Usually in the Philippines, they do like uh, Vice Gunda movies and things like that. Kind of silly, you know, movies. But this is actually a kind of a crazy movie. Lots of actors. Like I say, it was filmed in Manila and Quezon City. 
and it was all done in Filipino actors and it's a really a great job. And they had subtitles that were English. I like that one. Block Z, I'd say thumbs up. Go see it. It's a good movie.